Yep, just like this. No sea monsters and no mysterious organizations. Disappointed? No. It's not like that. Whether or not the world likes you depends entirely on whether your friends like you. Everyone has a few close friends. As long as those close friends like you, then the whole world likes you. You know, the kind of friends who would always believe you and always stick by you, no matter what. If the world should really turn its back on you, then I'll turn my back on the world. I'm your friend. And, you'll see, you'll have even more close friends further down the road. Having close friends like us is the same as having the whole world liking you. But as long as we're your close friends, how can we not like you? That's right. That's the spirit. I'm very proud of you. This is the platform. The last train will be here soon. Yep. It's gonna take a couple hours to reach Tokyo. This is a hermit crab. It's different from the other crabs. It lives inside a shell. We'll be arriving soon. Is there anything you'd like to say to him? She thanks you for watching over her these past few days. Take it. Dear passengers, 
This train is bound for Tokyo and about to leave. There will now be an announcement of the estimated time of arrival at each station. Somebody will be waiting for you at the station. Your family wouldn't like me. Sayonara. <sighs> Call Chisa again for me. This time, I'd like to decide for myself. Send someone to go get your sister. She is on the last train from Baishinji Machi to Tokyo. It left at 9.45. You. Goodbye. Let's go back. I know what you're thinking, but I don't want to talk about it. Leave me alone for a bit. already knew this. I have no choice. It's rare for him to have a goal of his own. My sights were on her the entire time. It was only my boss's last minute order that spared the girl's life. At this point, nobody can know what will happen next. I just hope our backup plan works. Take good care of Luminous, all right? and senpai would pay for our room? Or would they just shoot me like a traitor? If I were to confess and beg for mercy, would that work? Hmm? Maybe we should get our story straight before we go back. Aniki! D don't be like this! I beg you! No need to explain. We followed you to Baishinji Machi and saw everything. I let her go. She didn't know anything. This has nothing to do with her. It was me. He doesn't know anything either. Eri, sedatives and an IV drip won't be enough to get her to China. Huh. Let's grab a bite. Nani? What? Am I hearing this right? Is it mealtime already? Let's go grab a bite in the 24-hour ramen place over in the alley. I don't know if you did the right thing or not. Sometimes, the results of our actions are unpredictable. And we can only act on what we think in that moment. We drove all the way back and haven't eaten anything. Let's go. I'm hungry too. I convinced the newbie. Joining the student union is going to be one of the best decisions he'll ever make. I... I must get her things together so I can ship them to her. What's so hard about this? The three of us can get it done for you in no time. Listen up, everyone. We are going to pack up everything in this place. Spend the night here before heading back to Takamagahara. It's all paid for. It's not like you have a lot of clients in Takamagahara Bar. It's just one night. We can cover for you. Thanks, Senpai. Hey, newbie. Stay here with Luminous. 
If something happens, tell us right away. We'll be heading back. I didn't mean to betray the college on purpose. What will the secret society do to me now? They aren't going to drill a hole into my shoulder bones and put a lock on them, are they? Oh wait, that's from Journey to the West. Let's get our story straight first. You won't sell me out, will you? Aria's actually pretty normal. She's nothing like the monster that they make her out to be. You've seen it yourself. Whatever I say, she listens. She also likes Gomoku fried rice and pretty skirts. Even if she did turn into the dragon that would destroy the world, would I really be able to shoot her in cold blood? What was Senpai thinking back then? The dragon girl must have broken his heart. You haven't heard Senpai's story, have you? The girl he liked turned into a real-life dragon. Senpai and I were on our way back to the academy when we ran into the strike. The train service wouldn't resume for another week, so we had to stay in a hotel in the meantime. Who knew we'd run into Shavi there? She just graduated. I don't think that's a good idea, Senpai. I'm all in favor of you paying for Shabby's lodging, but two guys and a girl in a single room. I think the disciplinary committee would take issue with that. The disciplinary committee doesn't care about that. Professor Manstein is probably preparing for this year's- I don't think it's appropriate either. But she said that she doesn't want me to pay for a single room. She let it be known that she would rather set up camp in the park. The train strike is going to last a whole week? Can't our college do something? If there's a need, I'll pay for your room as well. Banzai Senpai! Senpai, reading is great, but how about sitting down while doing it? You can also practice your standing pose. I stand for half an hour every night because it's good for my spine. I do recommend it. Never mind. Finger would die laughing. From earth to heaven, then descend from heaven itself. Combine the powers of both above and below to attain the glory of the world. To keep away from darkness and ignorance. Newton's actual words were a bit more complex. You can also translate it as, It rises from earth to the heavens, and again it descends back to earth, receiving the force from things above and below. You shall have the glory of the world, and shall banish all darkness. Hmm. I believe the key to understanding this sentence is figuring out what it stands for. It means materials used for alchemy. In other words, metals or other matter used for burning. It could also be the spirit. There has been little progress on this theory since 1972. But last year, a new paper was published on this subject. Wait, wait, what are you talking about? Chevy, why are you standing by the wall too? The Emerald Tablet. Did you not pick Chemical Alchemy, Lu Senpai? It's an incomplete chapter from a dragon tome. Interpretations differ, though, because it's so hard to understand. What? Dragon Raja, Dragon Raja, Dragon Raja! She's from our preparation program, and she's taken the 3E exam already. So she's aware of the existence of the dragons. Her talent is A, an outstanding score. Preparatory? Preparatory what? It's the college's secret branch in China. It finds talented students to have them take the 3E exam. Shavi, female, entered the college's preparation course while still in high school and passed the 3E exam with flying colors. Family members include parents and an older brother. What's this, invasion of the privacy snatchers? Eva sent me the data. We needed to know your identity. My computer is on the coffee table. Luminous, pass it to Shavi for me. Why do I have to run errands? I haven't finished my homework yet. You're kidding me! Is this a photo of you? Great alternative style. 
am so not into that whole alternative style thing. I was cosplaying Haruhi Suzumiya for the Anime Society. To cosplay Haruhi Suzumiya? I wanted to cosplay Mikuru Asahina. Asahina? <laughs> but they all made fun of me, saying that I didn't have the goods. I hate those horrible busty girls! They were so mean to me! <laughs> I, I'm sorry. If Tai Chi means the spirit, then above and below actually mean the different spiritual realms. One dragon, one human. That works too. It describes the journey of self-fulfillment as a human transforms into a dragon. The translation you used was, Tai Chi went from earth to heaven, then descended from heaven itself. Thus he absorbed the powers of both above and below. Thus you attain the glory of the world, and keep away from ignorance. The way you read it, if humans can turn into dragons, then why would he need to return to the human world? The author wanted to keep away from ignorance. I don't understand. Why then did he descend from heaven itself, going from earth to heaven? That surely is the ultimate goal of any alchemist. From earth to heaven, from heaven to earth, creation sure is amazing, amazing to me, amazing to me, amazing to me, la 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 la. There's a set of scales between heaven and earth, and its weights are the common people. Uh, how could this happen? How did your academic discussion ever turn into karaoke singing? But I was trying to include you in the conversation. Tell me, do you know the theme song to Barba Papa? I seem to recall. I can't tell, Senpai. When I think back on that warm, sunny afternoon, it always feels like we didn't do anything important at all. Shavi told a lot of lame jokes and discussed academic stuff with Senpai. Senpai even sang an anime theme song, which was totally unlike him. When you think about it, we did nothing but waste time that afternoon. But you always want more afternoons like that, and you never want them to end. Then the very next day, the principal sent me on a horrible mission while the ever-expressionless senpai got to accompany Shavi to an amusement park. Under the pretense of freshman training, there's no justice in this world. I was running dangerous errands for the principal, the two of them were on a ferris wheel together. That's almost like a date. Now it's time for freshman training. But senpai, we are here, on a ferris wheel. Yes. I chose the ferris wheel on purpose, because our freshman training can't be done in a crowd. The pod holds two people, and we are 50 meters above ground. We will stay here for 10 minutes, enough time for me to finish your training. And there I was, thinking you had fallen for my looks. Do you know what it means to take a girl on a ferris wheel ride? Is the ferris wheel different from other rides? Do you actually know the top three spots for having a date? What is it? Movie theaters, aquariums, and ferris wheels. It's dark inside a movie theater, and that makes for a naturally intimate setting. Besides, if you're watching a horror flick, it's like a free pass to hold the girl's hand. A visit to the aquarium means that you're an educated animal lover. Girls really appreciate that. Besides, that blue underwater tunnel has a warm and mysterious quality that makes you feel like you're in a different world altogether. The Ferris wheel is the best place to ask a girl out. You're on your own together, and the girl has to hear you out. When the Ferris wheel reaches its highest point, whip out that rose, get on your knees, and profess your undying love for her. You have a full 10 minutes at your disposal! For some guys, 10 minutes is enough to talk a sea turtle into shedding tears! Why would anybody want to make a sea turtle cry? That's not the point! The point is, the Ferris wheel is a romantic spot! And in a romantic spot, you don't talk about annoying things! Freshman training. Are you annoyed by this topic? Well, I guess that depends. 
All right then. It's not as annoying as throwing a big hairy dead spider on a girl and then having a good laugh about it. This is my first time visiting an amusement park with somebody. I can't really tell. Actually, I've always wanted to. Once I came here by myself and in secret, but it turned out to be pretty boring. Really? My brother is developmentally challenged. My parents spend all their weekends at home with him. If I want to go to the amusement park, I have to go by myself. But who in their right mind does that? I thought your family spoiled you. Why is that? It's just a feeling. We are twins. My brother came out first. I took my time and came out six hours later. The medical staff were at their wit's end, and they forgot to check on my brother. He had breathing difficulties, and being unattended to for half an hour caused him developmental problems. So my parents always said that he sacrificed himself for me. He could have been really smart and successful. That's why I need to do better than everyone else, because whatever I do, my brother is helping me. So no matter how hard I try, I'll never get any praise. You don't like your brother? No, I love him. Maybe it's because we were together for a whole nine months inside our mom's womb. He's very affectionate with me. He can get very agitated, but I can calm him down just by talking to him, even when our parents can't. I hate it when others pick on him. When we were little and I took him with me for errands, we would get so many weird looks from people. They would say things like, How irresponsible! They let a little girl go out with a dummy! My brother might not have understood their words, but being very sensitive, he would cling to my skirt and not let go. You're so devoted to your brother. Sometimes, I wish he'd never been born. That way he wouldn't have had to suffer so much. I'm sure he'd love it if he could come to the amusement park. Hmm. <clears throat> this we call Pathos of Blood. As a group of hybrids, we stick together because we share the same blood, and an inability to assimilate into society at large. Let me remind you we're still on the Ferris wheel. The weather is great and we can see far into the distance. Can't we talk about our hopes and dreams? I learned all about freshman training back in prep school. Dear guests, you must have been talking a lot about your hopes and your dreams. Well, time flies. Welcome back to the surface. Pr principal I went to an event with Luminous in the morning. Nothing important in the afternoon. Luminous said he's never been to the amusement park. He's not happy about us asking him to attend events rather than letting him train his young and good-looking schoolmates. Take him to the amusement park. Hey, Senpai, should we go get an ice cream? There's an ice cream cart over there! You can't bribe me. a boring flavor. It's like you're stuck in the last century, Senpai. Leave me alone. This is a classic flavor. Even the principal is cooler than you guys. And speaking of cool, he's having the all-new mint flavor. Totally hip! I actually prefer lemon flavor. You know, when people get older, they start to resent the absence of new and exciting experiences in their shortening lives. So, I'm going to pick the most popular one. Ah, oh, taking a walk with a beautiful girl makes me feel young once again. I feel excitement and joy running through my veins. What a load of bull. More like his long dormant male hormones have awakened. Senpai, you're so sneaky. I'm not one to stir things up, but if I were you, I wouldn't stand for someone flirting with my girl right in front of me. What does this have to do with me? You need to seize the chance, senpai! Look! A roller coaster! Wow! 
This is the Midgard Snake, the most adrenaline pumping roller coaster in the world. 150 meters high and a top speed of 250 kilometers per hour. She's not serious, is she? Why would a girl be into roller coasters? Let's go for a ride! It looks super cool! Ha! Huh? That will be a fun ride. Let's go! Yes! Come on! Don't tell me! Come on, guys! Let's go! Senpai, I can see your face twitching. I might get sick. Be honest with yourself. If you're scared, just admit it. It's nothing to be ashamed about. Besides, it's better than getting killed. Just admit it, Senpai. Your favorite ride is the Snow White Castle. Just say it, and we can all go there. You know you want? It's gonna be bad for all of us! If I may confess, my favorite ride is actually Rainbow Pony and Friends. Hurry up! Come here! I saved you the best! Yes, here we go! No, we fell for it. Don't be silly. Neither Rainbow Pony nor Snow White will be able to save us now. What happened? The car has already derailed. It will not stay attached to the tracks. When it passes the highest point, it will send us all flying through the air. Judging from its speed, the roller coaster will reach the highest point in six seconds. I can extend the time in my zone by a factor of 50. That will give us 300 seconds. Zero time's actual effect has always been a secret, but if I had to guess, I'd say that it doesn't slow down time. Rather, it changes the way we perceive time. Yes, but this ability has no effect on the body. It can't make us any faster. We need a plan, or everyone on this roller coaster is going to die. A normal timer doesn't work in the time zero zone. I guess we have about 250 seconds. This roller coaster has a magnetic brake. We can stop this thing? Even if we pull the brake now, we'll end up flying into the air! However, right before the roller coaster hits the highest point, it'll already have slowed down. Just apply the brake a little, then it won't have enough momentum to pass through the highest point. Instead, it'll go back where it came from, all the way into the tunnel. Hey, how do you know all that? Isn't your favorite Rainbow Pony and friends? And don't you hate roller coasters? I wasn't too sure about this. So I looked it up on my cell phone while we were lining up. That's our senpai! Science geek to the rescue once again! The brake can only stop the roller coaster when its momentum is close to zero. We have to engage the brake when the roller coaster reaches the highest point in its trajectory. How do we activate the brake? There is a transformer located at the rear. It converts low voltage from a track into the high voltage required to activate the brake. I'm sure the fail-safe button is in the control box down there. If we open the rear cover, I should be able to detach the firewire drive and activate the brake. Is there anything you can't do, Senpai? That's Alchemist Engineering. Wow. Science students are so cool. There is nothing more I can do. I'm already struggling to maintain the zone. I may pass out at any time. Johan. I'm assigning you command of this operation. You have full authority. Roger. Xavi, watch over the principal and make sure the padlock is on. If the principal gets too exhausted, zero time will stop working. Luminous, look at the front. When we're 10 meters away, signal me and I'll break. Luminous, get in the back and activate the brake. I'll hold it off. Ah! Senpai, you have a death 
something? Now! Don't be stupid! You really are going to die! I can only hold it back for a second. Just do it! Senpai, you really are gonna die! Listen to me. It doesn't matter if you activate the break or not. I won't be able to go back. Just do what you're supposed to do and trust me with the rest. 